The Defence Minister and Veteran Commander Bismillah Khan was not at his home when it and buildings around it in the most secure part of Kabul were targeted. But his bodyguards were among those injured in the bomb blast, the biggest in the capital in almost four months. These pictures, filmed by the government, show the scene immediately after the blast. The Interior Minister, Abdul Sattar Mizakwal, directing commandos, who we are told secured the area after a number of hours. This is what experts call a complex attack. First, the car bomb was detonated, then attackers made their way into the building. There was a firefight lasting several hours. The Taliban say this is the beginning of a new campaign targeting senior government officials in the capital. The Taliban are fighting a very different battle in the south of Afghanistan, aimed at conquering territory rather than causing disruption. Their focus right now appears to be the provincial capital of Helmand, Lashkagar. For days, they've been fighting in the heart of the city. The Afghan military has called on people to evacuate their homes, but one local resident told Al Jazeera he can't leave his house because there's fighting on the street outside and his family is running out of food. We are very worried. The situation in Lashkargah is very dire. The warfare is going right now in the urban setting among the civilians. Civilian population is not the target. Schools, medical infrastructure, hospitals, uh, housing facilities are not a place where the military activities should take place. The UN are calling for an immediate ceasefire, but the opposite is happening. The violence is intensifying.